Hey guys, it's Darlene and welcome to my channel. All right, so today's video is what's new this week. So without further ado, let's go ahead and jump in. All right, first and foremost, if you're already subscribed to my channel, I just wanna say thank you so very much. If you are not yet subscribed and these videos are of interest to you, be sure to hit that subscribe button as well as that notification bell, and that way you won't miss out on any video. This week was an epic fail. I was supposed to on Friday have the animal print, uh, how to add animal print to your fall wardrobe, and Express, which I had ordered quite a bit of pieces from, uh, they had <clears throat> they had a problem with their warehouse. Um, so they will be delivered on Tuesday, so or Monday, Monday or Tuesday, and so I will have that video up on Wednesday because there were such a, if there was only like two or three pieces, I would be like, okay, whatever, I've got plenty. And I do have plenty, but there are some great pieces and they are still on sale, so I really wanna get that too. So those are the videos that'll be up this week. Let's talk about what came in this week, okay. So uh, let's go ahead and start with beauty. Uh, let's talk about a couple products uh, that came in and then one that I've been trying for quite some time. Okay, so I have two products here from Juno. I briefly mentioned this. Uh, this is a two-in-one, so it is a moisturizer as well as a primer. I will show you it here. Now, um, really nice, thick, creamy, and the benefit of this, sort of just like the benefit of the City Beauty Skin Perfecting Daily Veil, is it's a multitasker, and you guys know how I feel about a multitasker. I love love products that can do more than one thing. And this does, so it's a moisturizer as well as a primer. The price point is so good, you all, so good. Two main ingredients in the moisturizer is avocado oil and hyaluronic acid. So we're getting some really, really good ingredients. They are um, what I would consider a clean company and they are releasing a new line and it's called Juno Skin. This is not sponsored. And um, so they're gonna be several products. The one that I'm trying is Juno Skin Clean 10 and it is a cleansing balm. The thing about this is literally there's 10 ingredients. Yes, 10 ingredients. Let me go ahead and show you. I used it, oh my God, obsessed with this. First of all, I try a lot of face washes, right? Like, like you know, and I've said this to you all before. I've never had one where I've gone, wow, this is really, this is it, this is the, this is it. Um, I tried Elemis's cleansing balm and I liked it, but I do not like the price point. Y'all, this is under $15. Plus they gave me a coupon code. So I mean, you know, and look how much you get. So let me just say it comes with a little spatula so you don't have to dig your grimy little fingers in there, which I appreciate. And then it's this beautiful, nice, thick balm. You only need about a one little spatula full of it and it smells so fresh. I, I, I've been smelling this for days thinking, how am I gonna describe this? And it's just this sort of really, if I had to say, it's almost a citrusy freshness to it. That is what I will say. Um, it just smells divine. You put a little on your fingers, rub it in, you just warm it up, and then you put it on your face. You can put it on your eyes, your lips, it's all clean ingredients in here. So it's great because it can go over your mascara and your eyeliner and your eyeshadow and it's not gonna burn or sting or any of that goodness. And your face will feel so soft and so refreshed and so clean. I mean, it really does a excellent job. And I'm a double cleanser. So afterwards, I did do the micellar and there was hardly anything on the pad. There will always, regardless of if I spent 30 minutes cleaning my face, be something that I missed, you know, maybe in the hairline or a little mascara or something. But this really cleans very, very well. The two super ingredients in here, I have to pull the cheaters out, 
are pearl barley, which that's their star ingredient. It aids in skin brightening, reduces the appearance of hyperpigmentation and dark spots, hydrates and nourishes the skin, and refines the texture, as well as vitamin E, which obviously is an anti-aging um, antioxidant. There we go. Um, so you're supposed to really feel, and this is the true, uh, I felt um, your skin will feel cleansed but not dry. It'll feel moisturized. Um, it will not feel like you've literally stripped your skin. Does that make sense? So highly recommend it, really, really good, love it. Now, the other product that I've been trying, um, I told you about each and every because they were a, a brand, they are a brand that supports breast cancer awareness. And um, I've been trying their deodorant and I am one of those people that have tried uh, all natural deodorants and they just don't work for me. I just sweat a lot, I guess. Um, this one works, so if you guys, um, I don't know if they're doing, we are now in November, so I don't think that they're doing the give back to breast cancer awareness um, right now, but I tried the lavender and lemon and I thought it was really good. Now, this was sent to me in PR, now mine. Now mine. Uh, this is the Pro One Device Complete Facial Solution. This is pretty, I'm pretty excited. Now, I am not gonna do a first impression on this. This is literally gonna take me about a month. Daily, it's a sonic facial cleanser. And so it has multivitamins and Dead Sea Minerals in the facial cleansing gel. And then once a week, you do the spa quality facial. So it has sonic exfoliation, sonic nour nourishment, sonic oxygenation and sonic protection using vitamin C. First time I'm even looking at it. So every so daily you use this side and then see this little circle right here? In there goes vitamin C um, in these little packets. Yes, little vitamin C tablet that goes in there and you oxygenate and exfoliate with vitamin C. It's a little, it's like these little uh, soft bristles, right? And you put on the facial cleansing gel, which has vitamin E, B3, B5, uh, and Dead Sea Minerals. So every day, okay, great. Then once a week, you go ahead and add that little vitamin C tablet to here, and you put this, whoop, you put this lubricating gel on, lubricating gel, and this has vitamin E and hyaluronic acid. And it's recommended for use with the vitamin C tablet to ensure results. So you do the vitamin C, do, that's how I'm getting it. Haven't tried it, gonna start it this weekend, super excited. In three weeks to a month, I will let you know. And of course, I'll do lots of before and after pictures because this is exciting. I've never seen anything um, like that. That's it for beauty. I get in some clothing and accessories that I wanted to share with you. Uh, the first is the dress that I'm wearing. This is from Ann Taylor, Obsessed. You know I love green. Green is such a beautiful color, especially for fall and winter. And um, what's great about this dress is you can accessorize it about a million ways. So I'm gonna show you a video here. Um, and it's so super soft, like liquidy soft. It does have uh, a little bit of a turtleneck, but nothing super tight, because otherwise I wouldn't like it. Cinches at the waist. I'm showing it with a belt. I show it without the belt. I've shown, I'm showing it with a pair of Vince Camuto open toe booties that would look really cute for animal print. Um, but the other thing that I think it looks just perfect with are these Crocs from Naturalizer. These little sandals that wrap around the, um, the ankle, they were on sale for $39, you guys. I hope you picked them up, so cute. I'm not sure if they're still available. If they are, I will list them. And then a little belt from Amazon, and I think the outfit's so cute. It's actually what I'm wearing today. <laughs> we're taking the boys, my son and um, 
uh, they're going to church. Uh, they're doing a Halloween thing where they, they wear masks and everything, you know, they're very safe. My church is extremely safe. Just so lightweight that you can then layer pieces over it as it does get colder. And those brown Sam Edelman boots would look so cute with that as well. Um, I'm also sporting some Ann Taylor earrings. Let me zoom you in. Oh, beautiful they are. They have sort of a purple hue or tint to them and I just think they're so pretty. They have quite a few pieces that um, I really want them to go on sale because I want them and I, I am. I'm a girl that loves a sale. So um, I've been waiting for, there's a couple pieces. I'm gonna show them here. So maybe you will wanna get them too when they go on sale. I picked up another dress from Ann Taylor as well. This one is even lighter um, and both are long. They're lined, yes, both are lined. This one is more of a brown taupe color. Again, perfect for fall. I paired that dress. I actually took a selfie of that dress at Nordstrom's. They have the best lighting. Wish I had that kind of lighting. Um, so the dress, I paired that with a pair of the Sam Edelman uh, boots, uh, cashmere gloves that I also got. And then the Thanksgiving mask, I just, I'm obsessed with that mask. It goes with everything. It will go with, well, I'm, that's the one I'll be wearing uh, with this dress as we go out today. And um, then I have like a shawl, like a, what do you call it? Like a wrap that I've had for a while. But um, I will try and find one that it's, I'm not going to be able to find the exact one because I got that at a boutique so long ago but um yeah it's uh so that uh, so i just love that outfit and uh love the dress and now um, the last outfit is a really pretty pleated skirt what i love about this is when i love the colors there's lots of blues uh different shades of navy uh and then it's pleated but some of the pleats go this way and some go straight like this so it really looks so unique and so pretty and so I just love that and I paired it with um, a blouse from Lily Silk and um, and then just a pair of the Sam Edelman boots and I think it looks so fantastic and then the earrings that I'm showing are the little Kendra Scott the blue I thought they went perfectly it would also look really cute with like an ivory sweater as well so I picked that one up also a pair of sunglasses now um, I picked these ones up off of Amazon um, I love these these are tortoise again um, they're I'm wearing them today uh, because I what I love about these I love aviators y'all know that uh, these have the tortoise shell and they're brown they also have several colors you know Amazon they'll have like a zillion colors but I like to do this y'all so this is what I like to do <laughs> and I can't do that with aviators because then it gets stuck in my hair excellent uh, price point um, and I needed a pair like this uh, that were in the Brown family. So I'm going to just show you my cashmere gloves. I actually recently picked these up and I love these. They are so cute. Um, I actually uh, had them on Instagram. I showed them on Instagram. I got to wear them the other day because it was like 45 50. and those cashmere gloves. So I love those. Those are so adorable. And so that's what I picked up for fashion this week is I picked up a new phone case. I know I do change my phone cases, but this one, supporting breast cancer awareness. So um, I just love the little wine glass and the little, the little pink ribbon. So it's always with me, which I really like. And then um, the wine came in for breast cancer awareness. Show you the unboxing again, would make a spectacular gift. Okay, so I wanted to do the unboxing. This is from Argo. I know I'm pronouncing that wrong, but the French wine that uh, for breast cancer awareness. So it says wine for every table, every occasion, every day. So cute. It's packaged so pretty, and I love that um, it uh, it has the little pink for breast cancer awareness, and it says small production, family owned, and responsibly farmed. And then on the other side, the the world of wine is just a text away. So really super cute. If it's still available, I just think this you could send it directly to somebody. This would make such a great gift. Um, so it comes with the two bottles of uh, rosé, their French wine, and um, and then two of the stemless wine glasses with the pink ribbon. And I love the idea of drinking pink. 
Um, so it's really cute and I, I just wanted to show you that they really did a great job packaging. It's a family owned winery. Uh, we used to own a, a vineyard so I really like supporting small wineries. All right guys, so that's it for the video this week. I hope you enjoyed it. As always, if you did, please be sure to give it a thumbs up. And as always, thank you so much. Have a great week and I will see you on Wednesday. Bye guys.